Mm -hmm. Let's catch another one of these guys, hey? Yeah, so I'm up here at Norton, Kansas, uh, which makes this lake. What is this lake? Keith Sebelius Reservoir? I do believe. Yeah, I, uh, on my way home from a little South Dakota Smalley trip. And this is on my way, and this lake always does pretty good for me. I'm always catching fish, so I'm here. I've been here for about 30 minutes, 20 or 30. And uh, this point right here is always good. The only drawback is it's like these 12 and 13 inch largemouth bass. Um, you know, I was kind of hoping to get into like some wipers today. Anyway, this is fun. Who doesn't like to catch these things all day? And this point, man, they're always on this point, always. But yeah, I literally, I went to one other spot where a lot of times we'll find the wipers up shallow and they weren't there today. So I figured I'd just zoom over here. I thought for sure there'd be like three or four boats on this point, but there's literally, there was nobody here. So I just pulled right up and uh, yeah, we've had some amazing fishing days right here. Me, my dad and my dad's neighbor kid, we caught like a hunter bass in like two hours right here. Just one right after the next. Um, no giants, they're all pretty cookie cutter, but nonetheless, it is still fun to catch them. And as you can see, they are on. So I'll show you what I'm using. Look at that, all of them right in the top of the mouth. Perfect. That, just what you want to see but again I mean they're just these little guys uh, using a little grub just a little soft plastic grub on this big grub head it's nice and heavy I can cast it a mile I can feel it really well and that's like a green pumpkin I guess there we go oh my gosh took it from him can you come back for it no? Oh yeah. Hold my pants down on that one. All right, let's get right back in there. We'll get him on this one. He won't be able to help himself. There we go, told you. He was already charged up. I just, I'm surprised. I mean, this is a Sunday. There's a ton of boats out here. How are, oh, I lost him. Lost him on the jump. How are there not more people on this point? I mean, unless they just don't want to, unless they're not looking to catch like 12 inch largemouth bass, maybe it would, that would be a good reason. But like, if I was out here with my kids, oh, they'd be having a blast right here. This is like a guaranteed grandpa take your grandkid fishing spot. I've never been on this lake and this spot doesn't produce. There we go. It's like clockwork and he come off. Man, they are experts at coming off. They take that little jump and boom, life saved. Okay, so I got this uh, six Sense glide bait. I'm gonna throw that over there just for the heck of it, see if it does anything. Maybe it'll pick out a big one. Oh my goodness, something hit it. Just reeling it in. Whoa, something's hitting it right here. What the heck? There. Oh my gosh. No, no. Oh my gosh. What the heck was that? Oh my gosh. Oh, that sucked. I had to have been like a big wiper, man. Oh, it sucks so bad. There we go. 
There we go. What the heck is that? It's a freaking walleye. <laughs> oh man. It's a wally. There you go. Wonder if that's what hit it the first time too. Look at that little dude. He might be a good eater. And yeah, so this is what I caught him on the little six cents glide bait here. I wonder if that other one was a walleye as well. Okay, well they're still there. Um, I was throwing the, I was kind of going after walleye there for a minute. I was throwing that big old swim bait again. I did that for a while, nothing happened, so I went back, went back with the old grub, and of course on the first cast, it's like once I got out of there for a little while and left them alone, then uh, boom, they were all over it. So, Let's see if we can get another one of those dudes. I was really hopeful on the, there we go. Oh, this one's a little bigger. Just keeping the tension on them. So even when they jump, I'm more likely to get them up in here. Come on, dude. Just like that. And of course they're all the same size. You know, nothing too spectacular or exciting, but I mean, that's two in a row, two casts in a row. We're catching fish, we're having fun. Well guys, I was really hoping to catch one more big one, but you know, hey, it was still fun. It was a short little video, I know. Uh, Norton, Norton, Kansas, come up here. I think this is Keith Sebelius Reservoir, I believe. It's a good little lake. It's, it's a small enough lake. You can get around on it easy. The state park area, by the groundhogs, yes, groundhogs. It's got two decent boat ramps, lots of parking, um, a nice little courtesy dock, a fish cleaning station that's handy, um, everything you would need. So it's a nice area, it's a good little lake, it's relatively clean, and there's a great variety of fish. Every time I come here, you know, we catch different fish. So if you're in Kansas or in the vicinity, come check this lake out, it's fun. It's a fun time. There's never, I I mean, there's, this is the weekend and there's like maybe 15 boats out here. You're not like, you got plenty of space to move around. You don't have to worry about the people. So anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the video. I didn't show you everything because it was a lot of the same stuff, but I had a blast out here. Anyway, thanks so much for watching guys. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And uh, I will see you on the next adventure. Be blessed.